Yeah. Okay. Well, let's go on the role play here. This is gut selling here. Okay. And I'm recording this for you so you can use this later. Okay. This is the way I teach my mentoring students. Okay. Uh, so uh, let me ask you something, Mr. Boyd. Uh, how much you want for the property? Uh, I need to get about forty thousand for it. Is it forty thousand or about forty thousand? Give me a give me a number. Well, um, I've been working on it, and I've been putting, you know, doing some work to the house, and uh, I'm thinking about forty-five thousand. Okay, so we're gonna, it's not forty; it's forty-five. So if you got, if I made you an, so forty-five thousand would make you happy. Yeah, but I I, I need to talk to uh, uh, I need to talk to somebody else first before I make that decision. No, sir. We're talking, we're doing business right now. I'd like to do business with you, um, but I, 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 I'm a straight shooter. Um, tell me what you need, what you want, and we'll do a deal right now. Well, like I said, I'm thinking about 45,000, um, but uh, I, I got somebody else I need to talk to first, and I got, I've had a few other people come in and- So you and, don't want to uh, do business with property. You don't want to do all, so just so I understand, sir, not trying to be uh, impolite or rush you or anything. So you don't want to do a deal with me right now, for no matter what we off, what no matter what number we talk about. Well, um, I'm I'm definitely not in a position where I want to give the property away. Um, I, didn't ask, is, I didn't ask for your way. I just asked you what you want. And now we can do business right now. You tell me. If we can do four to five thousand, I may be able to do something with that. Why don't you go over and take a come and take a look at the property first, and then tell me what you think? No, well, I'm ready to do it right now. I'll take a look at the property and let me bring something a little gift over for you and your wife. Um, but you just said you may do four. Is forty five thousand your price? Yes or no? Yeah, I can, I can probably do about forty five thousand. Okay. Off the role play, you're doing this beautifully, by the way. You're saying may, could, probably. And that's what I got from him. <laughs> okay. Did you pick up on those wishy-washy words? Yeah, yeah. Okay. What yeah. You, you've got to shut up. You've got to make him paint himself into a corner. Do you notice how I don't respond with a presentation? I, mean, I just keep turning your, que your statements into my questions. Do you, you hear that? Yeah, yeah. Okay, what am I doing? I'm trying to pin you down, get a commitment. I'm using psychology. Okay, I'm a student, a psychologist of persuasion and influence. I got very close. She said, if I got 45,000, I may do this. So let's go pick it up from, I think that's what you said. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so Mr. Boyd, um, by the way, can I call you Christopher? I'm Claude. Yes, that's fine. Oh, uh, fine. So is His it, name is Chris too, by the so, way. Oh, okay, Chris? Yes. Okay, Chris. So if you got, uh, if you, if I, if I, if I agree to forty-five thousand right now, and I could, do you want to close quickly or slowly? How much time do you need to move? Um, well, the house is already vacant. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay. There hadn't okay. been anybody there. I, I bought the house for my daughter, um, but she passed away some years ago, and nobody's oh, I'm so been. So sorry. Oh, what a heartbreak. I'm so sorry. And uh, so, you know, we've been just going over, just kind of doing little things to it, just kind of considering whether or not we want to uh, fix it back up and rent it out or, or sell it. What would you But I, I'm thinking about selling it. Okay. And what are you going to do with that $45,000 if you and I decide to move forward today? I haven't actually decided yet. Okay. Well, you, it'd be nice. Pay off some bills, take a vacation, get a nice car, something, or put it for retirement, something like that. Yeah, but my health is not doing too well, so it won't be too much vacation in. Okay, well, I understand that. It's good to, you know, when you need medical attention, it's nice to have money, right? Oh, yeah. It, definitely nice. I can understand your situation. Very uh, good. Off the role play, this is part developing what we call, nur this is nurturing. People, part of the psychological makeup of the other person is to pin them down, to get sp specific commitments, also to stroke and nurture. Uh, stroking is sincere compliments. Nurturing is when you get them, when you get them emotionally connected with you. This goes right okay. to, the, this is where, what, what I'm doing with you right now is getting you out of your critical um, conscious mind and going to your subconscious mind. 
Okay, it's going right in there. And I'm trying to paint a picture. Hey, you sell the house, no problem. You got the money. I'm painting a picture in your head. And then I'm now I'm gonna come back to the close again. So let me ask you something, let me ask you something, Chris. You're a nice man. Uh, I'm interested in your house. I'm looking at two, three other houses in the neighborhood. I know your neighborhood, I prefer to do it. If I made you an offer and it's okay to say no to me, um, if I made you an offer, I'd give you the $45,000, I can close in August, 30 days from now. Suppose I made you that offer, what would your response be to me? And it's okay to say no. Just please don't say maybe or should or could. Uh, well, well, right now, since I don't have time to talk to the person that I need to talk to, uh, I'm going to say no. Okay. How do you, to, before I go, how can you and I do business um, so you don't have any regrets when I get off this phone. Because what's going to be in your mind when I get off this phone is, gee, did I just lose a guy who wanted to pay me cash? He's not a BS or he's a straight shooter. And he seemed rather polite and nice, which is my nature to do how I do business, sir. Um, I, you're going to have regrets that you might have lost me as a potential buyer. Isn't that what's going to go through your mind? Uh, very possibly, but I just want to make sure that I'm doing the right thing. What do you, when you say the right thing, what do you mean? You made a commitment to somebody else or? Uh, no, um, I've just got so much tied up into it. I just want to make sure that I'm, uh, you know, getting, getting what I need to get out of. Well, I, you mentioned, you said 45,000 before you said originally 40, then you said 45. I agreed to the 45. I would like to do business with you, but I feel like we're on a fishing expedition. What do you think? Well, 45 is closer to what I really need to get out of it. And 45 is what I'm comfortable and what I've offered to pay you. What do you need from me in order to make a commitment and do business right now? When can we close on it? When would you like to close? Uh, well, I got some family coming in that's going to be here for about a week or so. Uh, why don't you give me a call? Um, no, sir. Give me a call in about 30 days and I can no. let you know. No, sir. Right now. I'll, you give me a date. I'll close whenever you want. I just want to know we have closed. We have closure right now. I can close on the 15th of August, the 30th of August. I can close on the 12th of August if you want your money even quicker. All right, we'll, we'll, we'll set something around the, the, the 15th of next month. How about okay. that? So if I send you an agreement right now for $45,000 for the 15th of August, and I send that to you right now, can you send me an agree? Can you send me that agreement back uh, before twelve thirty? Uh, just depending on how long it takes me to look over it. Um, Very you know, simple. I, got some... I give you cash. You give me house. Very simple. Okay. Go ahead and send it on over, and I'll take a look at it. And then, what happens at four? What happens when we speak at three thirty this afternoon? I, ought to, I should have an answer by then. You don't have one right now for the money and everything else I'm offering you? I'd like a commitment. Okay, let's do it. Go ahead and send it to me, and what? I'll sign it. Go ahead and send it to me, and, um, and I'll go ahead and sign it. Okay, and I got a, hear a Walmart hearing aid. That was a yes? Yes, that's a yes. You're a gentleman, sir. It's a pleasure to do business with you. <laughs> what did you I like it. See, this is persuasion, influence. I'm also an authority figure right now. And you kept, you were beautiful, man. This is a classic, maybe, probably, shoulda, coulda, possibly, may do this, think about it, kind of. And you saw I kept going back. I did the regrets thing. And then we got back in the dialogue. And you I wouldn't give up. And you finally acquiesced because maybe something in your head said, I might lose this 